travel with us to Jacksonville, Florida tonight, and let's take a look at what's coming up on tonight's video. What you doing in my yard? Yeah, I, I hear you. Why are you in my yard? Going through the other side of the gate. I saw you checking my door. Running for the police. Running for the police. I saw you checking my door now. Why were you doing that? Yeah, man. All right. I, it wasn't on that type of level. It was on. I right, mean, I'm trying to duck off in the house because you're running from the police. You trying to duck off in my house because you're running from the police? I, I wasn't thinking. I wasn't. I wasn't trying to be like on some sneakers. I was just trying to get away. I was trying to duck off, not realizing it's your house, my house right here. It's me, neighbor. Ain't, ain't no type of, ain't no type of time like that. It's me standing next door. It's going bro. to be a disturbing one as usual. Without further ado, let's get started. Stolen cat. Wow, let's watch these two individuals steal this neighbor's cat. Let us know your thoughts on this one. Fire burn, cauldron bubble, leave your message on the double! <laughs> Thief walked up and took a small bug zapper off this front porch which was not visible from the street. Homeowner got a good video of his face and clothes. He did a quick double take as he turned to leave. Keep an eye out for this guy and keep an eye on your bug zappers. Homeowner in this one wanted all watching to be careful and keep an eye on your packages. This brazen porch pirate stole mine and my neighbor's Amazon packages. Crazy man at the wrong door. This man walked up to this door around 2 in the afternoon. Homeowner said I'm currently away from home. I don't know if I should call the cops or what. He appeared to be upset and marked all over my camera with a permanent marker this is crazy and I am pissed. Please let us and the homeowner know your thoughts or any advice perhaps you may have. Thanks. Yes another porch pirate, doing what porch pirates do, just another day in the life of a criminal. He's probably been doing this for a while. Notice how calm he is walking to his car. Talk about brazen, not a care or scare in the world. Another weirdo trying to gain entry in another innocent person's home. Homeowner said this was at 4 in the morning. This chute should be home sleeping instead of out early creeping. Stay vigilant and keep those doors locked.
Roach thief. This homeowner wants their roach back. Keep an eye on even your roaches, my friends. We think most of you should find this next clip a little comical. We see a lot of people get away with their devious and disturbing not to mention malicious doings. Let's watch what happens when this not so good neighbor gets busted trying this homeowner's doorknob to gain unwelcomed entry. You hear me? No ma'am. What you doing in my yard? It's me, neighbor. Yeah, I, I hear you. Why are you in my yard? Boy, through the other side of the gate. I saw you checking my door. Burn for the police. Burn for the police. I saw you checking my door now. Why were you doing that? Yeah, man. All right, well, it wasn't on that type of level. It was on. Hey, man, I'm trying to duck off in the house because you're running from the police. You trying to duck off in my house because you're running from the police? I wasn't thinking, I wasn't, I wasn't trying to be like on some sneakers, I was just trying to get away. I was trying to duck off, not realizing it's your house, my house right here. It's me, neighbor, it ain't no type of, ain't no type of town like that, it's me just in that door, bro. Is it just us, or does this guy remind you of Kevin Hart? You heard me? So you say you didn't realize you were trying, it was my house, not your house? No, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, I was just trying to get in the door real quick, I ain't... Yeah, basically, bro. I'm not trying to be dumb, but like, yeah, in a way, in a way, not, bro. Can you believe the audacity of some people? All right. I'm go I ain't nothing. Don't be touching nothing. I already know what happened around here. I already know, bro. I ain't that type of person, bro. What? what I, I, be, I ain't dumb. I know you got the cameras. What? What you say? You already know. What? What you talking about? What happened? See that? That that window right there. What? What you say? You know happened? Look at him sweat bullets. Too funny to say the least. I talk to you when you get home. Then to make matters worse, he pretty much busted himself about the broken window. He then decides he has said too much. He shuts up pretty quick and takes the walk of shame back to his side of the fence. We hope you enjoyed this clip as much as we did. Please let us know your thoughts in the comments. Uh. Another doorknob wiggler attempting to gain entry into this residence. Man you really have to keep your doors locked when you live in Jacksonville. This seems to be a very common thing in these parts, we can't stress it enough. Always keep those doors locked and always stay vigilant my friends. Strange man at the front door at about 12 midnight. Does anyone sleep anymore? Maybe, maybe not. Yes, yes, He seems to have maybe a mental disability of some sort. He doesn't quite no. seem all there having a conversation with himself holding a cross. We get the impression that he is harmless and perhaps has dementia or something. However, these days you can never be too careful and should always assume the worst. Early morning porch pile. We have a stolen lawnmower in this one. We are sure he is going to just borrow it and return it when he is finished. Keep an eye on your lawnmowers. And last but not least we have a stolen bike in this last clip of the night. Keep your bikes locked up and those notifications on or this guy will steal your bike. In this clip we have a crazy man walking around with a hammer on this homeowner's front porch. Nothing to be frightened about here. Nothing scary about this guy at all. Be aware. Be vigilant.
and always keep your doors locked. This twisted and terrifying clip goes to show why you should always do just that. And a reminder to never confront a stranger in the night or even daylight at that matter. Absolutely terrifying to say the least. Please be aware if you're in the area. Two guys scoping out property. No, Does anyone I'm recognize so these I, two? Um, Homeowner said I, I have multiple the, videos of them the scoping out my property. One of the guys claims to be the grandson I of the old owners, no, but I know I'm that so for sorry. a fact to be false because I know I'm the only so other sorry. person that has owned this house. This bullshit isn't fooling no, anybody. I, I, Please I, tell I us your thoughts in the comments. Porch pirate. This thief stole an Amazon package off this porch. Hope he likes dog food. Because that's what this idiot stole. Homeowner of this residence said this man broke into our backyard and robbed multiple tools from two trucks and kept coming back and was checking all the cars from my apartment, he also was checking inside the cars and robbed coins from the car. He grabbed multiple bags of tools. Be aware of criminals like this and always keep your doors double locked. Including your gates. Owner of this ring cam said a man followed their brother home. Not sure if he's having an episode or what, but this definitely does not seem normal. Pretty sure most of you will agree. A lot of horror movies either start or end out this way. Weird and creepy to say the least. A second cam of this weirdo. Seems he perhaps drinks his own roughie. Perhaps a future Jeffrey Dahmer in the making. All the more reason this video should make you vigilant. Talk about goosebumps. Yikes. Stolen car left in broad daylight. Homeowner was upset about this one to say the least. They said some lowlife stole my nephew's Ubi that I just bought him because of his good behavior at school. He called me at 7.30am to tell me. How does it feel to steal from a four-year-old? If someone recognizes him please let me know or contact authorities. Absolutely shameful. Hey, bro, wrong door. I like that. Strange man in this one trying to enter into homes with keys that he found. Be aware and always be vigilant. Guy steals package right after packages are dropped off. Like right after. 
Does this seem a little sus to you? Let us know in the comments. Do you think the drop-off was in on it or was this criminal at the right place at the right time and just lucky? And just like that, in a matter of minutes we have another stolen package. Keep an eye on your packages. Things that go bump in the night. Stranger danger, keep those doors locked and those notifications on. They will warn you of gremlins creeping on your porch at night. If at first you get caught, try again and get caught a second time. Trespassing and burglary in this clip. This is the second time this guy has broke into this home. He was arrested before and let go the next day. We can only hope a second offense is much tougher and this criminal gets his life together. They say there is an idiot born every minute. Clips like this prove just that. Ridiculous. Stolen scissor lifts and trailer from this work lot. Blue Yukon SUV and a white cargo van. Any information would be appreciated. This brazen criminal breaks into this store to steal. Let's take a look at this chooch together and watch what happens. Coyote spotted in backyard. Yikes. Talk about scary. Keep your pets inside folks. Local homeless man thought it was okay to take a nap on this homeowner's front porch. He used the mat as a pillow. He was at least kind enough to lock the gate behind him as he entered and later left. Just after midnight this unknown individual walked up to this door and tried to gain entry before knocking. Keep those doors locked folks and be aware. Especially if you're in the area. Wrong place. Or do the car seats serve as a decoy to drop someone's guard or give the impression he has the wrong place? For the door right now. But if you'd like to leave a message, you can do it now. You can never be too careful these days and should always be vigilant and expect the unexpected. Let us know your thoughts on this one. Food stolen by neighbor. This clip makes us hangry here at Twisted TV. Can you believe the audacity of some brazen criminals? We would have chased that man down. You never touch another man's food. Let us know what you would have done in that situation in the comments below. Hey, boss man! Yo! Person entering property without permission. He was looking around, pacing back and forth. Rang the doorbell, looking through the window and he tried turning the knob of my front door to see if it was open. He is walking around and going down the alley with a broom and cart. 
Be careful homeowner said and be vigilant out there. Intruder in the area, be aware. We have a fox in this clip not to mention an unidentified falling object. As cute as the fox is, pay attention to the sky in the background. Alien spaceship or meteorite, please let us know your thoughts in the comments. A not so sly male thief in this one. Wait for it. And there it is. Not blatantly obvious or anything. Who does this woman think she is fooling? No. Hi, my name is Laura. I'm from the Public Health and Safety Department of the City of Fresno. Um, I was calling because we had a few complaints about uh, some health and safety regulation violations. So if you can give me a call back, phone number is area code 559-721-3527. Thank you. This stranger shows up on this front porch ringing this doorbell claiming she is with public health and safety of the state of Fresno. We call bullshit. Laura which is probably a fake name is not only a liar, but a male thief as well. Keep an eye out for this male thief klepto if you're in the area and always be vigilant my family and friends. Porch Pirates. We have a lady on a bike stealing a package off this front porch and handing it off to the driver in this SUV. Keep an eye on your packages. Well, hello. <coughs> Neighborhood thief checking car doors. Homeowners said this low life keeps cutting the fence for an entrance and checking cars. If you recognize this individual or have any information, please let us know. This repetitive criminal always seems to have the same shoes and the same gray backpack. Homeowners said they are tired of this. Go earn your money like a civilized person instead of being a problem to society. Homeless woman stealing two pairs of shoes in this clip. You can't even leave your shoes outside these days. Keep an eye on your shoes my friends. Another porch pirate and another stolen Amazon package. Ridiculous. Turn those notifications on and avoid this. Raccoon eluding police in this one. Sneaky little bandit. Keep your cats inside and watch out for these malicious little troublemakers as cute as they may seem. Female porch pirate. Not a care or scare in the world. Not even an attempt to cover her face. Turn those notifications on and avoid being a victim like this unfortunate homeowner. Homeless doorknob wiggler in this one. This homeless person is literally checking every door in sight. Absolutely shameful. This is one reason why you always want to keep your doors locked these days. Be aware, especially if you're in the area, and always be vigilant. Stolen scooter. Keep an eye on your scooter. Porch pirate. Wow. Looks like Christmas early for this low life. Almost looked like he bit off more than he can chew. Clearly not his first time because he rides off with his new stolen package with no problem at all. We hope you're enjoying the video. If you made it this far, please consider hitting that like and subscribe button so you don't miss out on new content uploaded almost daily. Heavy police activity in this clip. A wanted suspect running from police is arrested in this homeowner's front yard. Homeowners said they are not sure what happened, but around midnight some guy ran through our yard with several cop cars and a helicopter chasing him. As always please share your thoughts in the comments. Well, check out this little fella. Totally adorable and cute. Until it snags your cat and dips into the night in which it came. Keep your pets inside. I'm sure this young adolescent fox would surprise most people with how fast it could take your small pets. Nevertheless please share your thoughts in the comments. We think this footage is absolutely beautiful.
Let us know if you agree. We have a robbery in this one. This brazen malicious criminal attacks this poor woman and robs her of her purse. What makes this most sickening not to mention scary is that this innocent woman was in her car in her own driveway. Not to mention broad daylight. We ask kindly if anyone has any information please contact local authorities. Thanks. Foolish people driving recklessly spinning out and doing donuts. We were young once and can relate to the stupidity. Now that we are older and wiser we see this differently now than we did in our young days. Let us know your thoughts in the comments. What do you suppose we have in this one? Is this lady lost? Is this lady under the influence of drugs? We don't know, but what we do know is that she is definitely a late night door knob wiggler trying doors. Always keep your doors locked and always stay vigilant. Guy riding around on a bike stealing. Let's take a look together and see what happens. We can't tell exactly what he is stealing, but we can tell these cats know he is up to no good. This cat lady has way too many cats by the way. He should have taken a free cat with the whatever he stole. Let us know your thoughts in the comments of what he might have stole. And we were only kidding about the free cat comment by the way. Trespassing on private property. Homeowner said here is another incident on my front porch of a homeless person coming into my yard and onto my porch acting as if she wanted to sleep. This happened at 4am in the morning. Get the fuck up out of here now before I shoot your motherfucking ass. Get, hey, get, get this part up out of here. No, hell no, get this shit up out of here now. Get your shit, don't come through my gate. I got my shit, I know, I know what you do. Get up out of here, get that shit up out of here. No. What can I do to get these people from entering my property? Any thoughts? It's gotten out of control and I'm starting to feel unsafe in my own home. Hurry up. Get my shit up out of here. Close my gate, please. I don't want to have to bust my part of law, so please get on. Please share any thoughts or suggestions to possibly help this homeowner out. Thanks. Here we go again, another homeless person on the same porch. We see what the homeowner was saying when they said this is getting out of control. This happened at 1am in the morning and items were stolen. Crazy lady at night. This woman came up to this front porch at 1am in the morning trying to steal sandals that were outside. You can't even leave your smelly sandals outside to air out. What is this world coming to and what won't people steal these days? Gross not to mention ridiculous. Can I help you? Hi. I was going to I was asking if you know anybody about to help for that level. No, you need to go. You need to keep going. 
possibly intoxicated regardless clearly pulling an act. We have two shameful men stealing cash from a Buddhist temple. Clearly two more souls going straight to hell. Let's take a look at this twisted and disturbing behavior together and see what happens. This next clip is not only scary but completely terrifying. We have a pyro or an arsonist. This homeless man lights some trash cans on fire in this alley. Luckily this homeowner had his notifications on. This quick vigilant homeowner saves the day, or rather night. Let's take a look at this crazy footage together and see how it pans out. In this last clip of the night we have a Bonnie and Clyde porch pirate couple. These two are walking around this apartment complex stealing items off of residents' porches. One homeowner said the female came to the door and looked around. Moments later the male came back and took a pair of work shoes that were under a chair. Keep an eye on your work shoes. Not to mention definitely keep an eye out for these two if you're in the area. And always be aware especially if you live in Fresno, California. We have a sly thief in this one. Well he's the only one that thinks so. Check the face and be aware if you're in the area. And as always keep an eye on your packages. This next clip is a good reason not to go out when you live in Houston, Texas. Or think twice who you get into shit with. We have a shooting at 1100 Roy. Be vigilant and be careful out there my friends. Let's take a look. Finally here comes Haley, click clacking her ass about 2 minutes too late. Glad bro didn't leave his girl hanging after a shootout. Another 30 seconds and perhaps a different story. Just glad to say as far as we know, no one was injured.
A person approached this door this morning asking to come in. Homeowners said after a few minutes they left. Just sharing in case anyone sees this person around or has before. Please be aware. Man wearing a mask stealing packages in a U-Haul truck. The way he is driving we would not at all be surprised if it is a stolen vehicle as well. Shameful to say the least. How many of you wanna agree this U-Haul bandit probably doesn't even have a license? Chooch alert. Chooch wearing a flash t-shirt and trying doorknobs during the day. Check this gremlin out after midnight. Not even your balconies are safe. Yikes. This stranger attempts to gain illegal entry into this resident's home. Be aware of late night door knob wigglers. And as you should already know, always keep your doors locked. Persistent little creeper this one is. The lights come on and he still creeps. Yikes. Turn those notifications on immediately. Homeowner in this clip said my truck was stolen out of my driveway. It took less than a minute. They disabled on star but I had another tracker. Found the truck days later and had the police tow it for evidence. We at Twisted TV say that was strangely quick on how fast they stole this vehicle. Something doesn't quite add up in this one. Please let us know your thoughts in the comments. Suspicious activity. An older woman walked up to this home at 11 p.m. last night. Homeowners said she looked lost and I didn't think anything of it until I saw the same lady again just before 6 a.m. this morning. She was looking through my vehicle windows and trying to open the doors. Not sure if she has dementia and perhaps lost or what. Just making all aware. Thanks. And keep an eye on your grandmas. We have a trespasser coming into this garage around 3 a.m. in the morning. He opened the door to this homeowner's car, took a cup of quarters out of the center console, and left. Homeowner admits they accidentally left the garage open at 11 p.m. during the night. We at Twisted TV say it could have been much worse. We all make mistakes and forget things. Let it be a lesson to you and all watching. Don't forget to shut and lock all your doors. And always expect the unexpected. And like the chooch that this low-life thief is, he leaves with his cup of quarters and probably feels he scored. Keep your garage doors shut and locked. 
Don't make a mistake like this homeowner and lose your cup of quarters. Yes and of course we have a porch pirate in this one. A grown ass man stealing packages around 2pm in the broad daylight. Looks like he has a partner in crime. Two grown ass men that do this with their lives. This partner in crime pulls up in a grey truck to pick this fumbling ass clown idiot up. Keep an eye on your packages. Speaking of ass clown idiots, we have another porch pirate doing what porch pirates do. Turn on your notifications. Unknown man trespassing on front porch. Sir, get off my porch. Okay, I'm looking for a plug. Please get off my porch now, or I'm gonna call the cops. This woman walked by my camera, waited until she thought she was out of view, turned around and grabbed my packages. Another porch pirate strikes again. Stolen tires in this one. Keep an eye not only on your cars, but the tires that drive your car. Ridiculous. Gable's apartments. The fire alarm in the building is going off. Not sure if this is a false alarm or what but no one seems to be leaving. Eerie and a little apocalyptic to say the least. Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Car thieves. These two scumbags stealing from cars. Keep your doors locked and be aware if you're in the area. Mail thief with a master key. What the hell kind of score can be made by raiding mailboxes like this these days? Completely shameful, not to mention a felony act. Stealing smelly shoes almost makes more sense than this. Let us know your thoughts in the comments as usual. We will just never understand this one. And last, but not least, the last video of the night, another porch pirate. Go ahead and say it with us at this point. Turn him notifications on and keep an eye on your packages. This brazen stranger goes straight for the doorknob and tries to enter these people's home. How frightening. Police have been notified and a report has been filed. Be aware if you're in the area.
fox visiting this homeowner's yard and front porch multiple times now. What a beautiful red fox. Be aware and keep your pets inside. Jesus Christ, check this porch pirate out. Seems a little excessive not to mention ridiculous. All this and he didn't even hide his face. This idiot takes the chooch award for sure on this one. I mean come on man, buy a mask or wear a hoodie at least. Nevertheless we enjoyed watching stupidity at its finest. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks. Break in on this one. This stranger broke into this backyard shed in the early hours of morning. Keep your doors locked my friends. Man tripping rings doorbell at 2 a.m. I got 15 minutes, which is 15 minutes. You cannot shoot or do anything. Take you, take you, take you, take you. Homeowner said this is the first time we've had something like this happen since we moved here in 2021. Based on his paranoid and outlandish comments, I think he's tripping hard. Telephone phone never leaves, all right? Hi. Please oh. wait. It may take me a moment to answer. What did I? Need so many people. You don't need all the for Hey there, what do you want? Hey, how are you doing, sir? Oh, I was just watering. Uh, this man is clearly yeah. under the influence of See. something. He I can't even I'm remember asking. what he was going to say one second ago. Oh. Can you just move along? There's a water, but could you, could you buy me, uh, give me a favor and uh, call a taxi for me? I got lost. Uh, right? No? No, but there's a, uh, there's a convenience store, just across oh. the river. Across the river? Mm-hmm. <sighs> Up on 21st. So, that, and to the grass. Please and thank you. Please and thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. No, that's the other direction. Time. No knives and swords or nothing. Goes both ways. Five hundred thousand million years. Go with your rule. And that's all I'm saying. Take you, take you, take you, take you, take you, take While he didn't actually commit a crime in the video, it's suspicious that he's holding a can. The government to him, leaving the property. I can call the police for you if you'd like. That's fine, sir. Then we're good. Hey, I'm gonna leave the property now. Um, I get uh, 15 minutes now. 15 minutes, that's 15 minutes. You take, you take, you Perhaps take, you to spray whoever opens yeah. the door, and if he did commit a crime nearby before or after, maybe this video will help identify him, right as it shows him and his back tattoo clearly. All police departments, everybody turn her mayor now is not invisible for a hundred years. It's all wrong. No, it's all wrong. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Be aware and always be vigilant out there. Another man clearly under the influence of something. This man showed up on this porch at 3.49 a.m. He hung out for an hour. Can't tell if he is talking to someone off the porch or talking to himself. More than likely himself. He is obviously on drugs or having a mental health crisis. Sir, I, can you help me? Sir, I saw you. Why are you running away? Because I'm naked? Huh? Is that right? In this clip we have a trespasser that steals a bike. We don't catch it on the clip but homeowners verified. Let's check it out.
scouting houses to rob. This person walked all around this house and fenced in yard. Didn't steal anything, but appears to be scouting. When we have seen this in the past we see an uptick in attempted break-ins the next few days. Keep your eyes open and stay vigilant. trespassing and theft in this one. Anyone able to identify this criminal? Homeowners said he was trespassing on their property in the morning and stole their gaskin. Hopefully we just have a thief in this one and not an arsonist. Shameful regardless. Here is a second video clip of this trespassing gaskin thief. We have a chooch, trying doorknobs in the early hours of morning. If you listen closely, it sounds like he does the same to the next door of this residence. Stolen bike. This woman steals a bike off this front porch and walks off. She pretends to ring the doorbell, just in case someone is watching. When she feels the coast is clear she walks off with the bike. Question. Why not ride off into the distance like every other bike thief? She walks off with it instead. Clearly not an experienced thief and clearly not a rider. Beware. Attempted theft and gunshots fired. One of the homeowners said these people came onto the property around 5.45 a.m. as my husband was walking out to go to work. Once they seen him, the man goes running and the driver started to shoot. They shot eight rounds. She said both men appeared to have guns and were shooting. A police report has been made. Let's check this scary clip out and tell us what you think of this one in the comments. Thanks. We don't see gunshots in this. Regardless we thought we would show it. During this clip would be a good time for us to say thank you for watching the video. If you're not subscribed already, please consider showing your support by hitting that like and subscribe button. We upload new content weekly, most times daily. In doing so you will never miss out on our newest content. Hit that subscribe button so we can welcome you to the family and thank you for being part of the Twisted TV crew. Without further ado let's continue.
This man walked across this patio through a locked gate then back out. Only to return an hour later to fuss with the ring camera on the side door. On his second trip he came through the gate but never went back out. So he was either hiding on the property or got out through an adjacent yard. The police arrived fairly soon and searched but didn't find him. Stealing plants. We have a green thumb plant thief in this clip. Let's take a look. Lawn mower thief. This brazen criminal enters these homeowners front porch to steal something. He decides to steal a lawnmower. Homeowners confront him and he doesn't have a care or scare in the world. Excuse me. He still continues and steals the lawnmower. Let's watch what happens. We almost guarantee that this thief has no yard of his own to mow. He probably doesn't even know how to start the damn thing. He is clearly looking for items to sell. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Unfortunately, probably for drug money. Let us know your thoughts in the comments as always. And thanks for watching. Excuse me. No se lleva mi esa. Excuse me. Voy a llamar a Polish. Hey. 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 Yo sí se puede llevar la la asador también. Yo le dije, mami, hay que meterla por ahí, la quiso dejar. Dile a tu mamá si llama a la policía, ella puede llamar. Excuse me. Wow, talk about the audacity. Can you believe this brazen criminal thief? What do you think is going to happen in this clip? If you guessed two drunk guys come from nowhere and steal the cones, you were right. The real question is what are they going to do with these cones? Cone thieves. If you know these guys, kindly ask them to return the property. Keep an eye on your cones. What do you think these guys were going to actually do with these cones? Please leave your thoughts in the comments. Thanks. Hit and run. Homeowners said this happened at 1.45 a.m. in the morning. Looks like a light green and a grey, silver Kia Soul racing down our street. They then lose control and the light green one ends up in our yard. Police have been called but have not yet shown up. Any information you may have would be helpful. There was a truck that stopped and told us the guys ran into a house on Wheeling but didn't see exactly which house. I will update with report number later. Thanks. Really? This is why we can't have nice things. We have a greedy Halloween candy abduction. Don't forget to brush your teeth. Clearly no treats means trick in this one. We have a pumpkin smasher. At 8.30 p.m. on Halloween this guy stole our candy bowl.
vehicle crashed near 33rd and Oliver Avenue. One suspected has been arrested, another was last seen running toward Lucy Laney. Both male and female looked mid-teens. Be aware. Seriously, this kid actually stole the bowl we used to give out candy. Sad. We have some more pumpkin bashing and smashing in this next one. We have an unexpected visitor that fit right in with this video. Absolutely beautiful. Check this little fella out. What a hoot. Barbershop break-in. Two guys broke into the Keep Barbershop. Any information please contact local authorities. Thanks. This next clip is a little on the creepy side, not to mention completely scary if this is your home. This man shows up on this front door wearing a hospital gown trying to pick this front door with what looks to us like a plastic knife. Keep those doors locked, your notifications on and be safe. In case you're thinking they look cute and innocent, they stole the pumpkin-shaped basket of candy. Another cute, but not so innocent greedy couple stealing your full candy bowl. We have a suspicious woman ringing this doorbell around 1 in the morning. When the ring doorbell automatic response says, not interested, she says the unthinkable. Not interested. Have a great day. Let's take a scary look together and watch what happens. Not even? If I blow your fucking head off? This homeowner advises not answering your door these days. We at Twisted TV are glad she is speaking rational and not losing her head over something so ridiculous. Cody, I don't give a fuck about you! Tell her Cody. Assuming Cody is the dog barking in the background. Wrong house or ex-relationship perhaps. Is Cody inside not answering or is Cody the dog in the background barking his ass off? Please let us know in the comments what your thoughts are on this clip and who you think the dog is. And who is Cody? Hope your trash cans are full for this next one. Because we no longer need plutonium. Doc, you better back up. We don't have enough road to get up to 88. Roads? Where we're going, we don't need roads. Well, this next clip is clearly no DeLorean. But the driver clearly loves Back to the Future as much as us and perhaps thinks he is Professor Emmett Brown or rather Doc in a scene from Back to the Future. Be vigilant of crazy drivers. Be sure to padlock and double chain your front gate and avoid situations like this. We have Ghostface in this one stealing your ring cam. Yikes. Turn those notifications on.
and we know you would have never guessed it unless we ruined it for you. Brace yourselves. We have another candy bowl thief in this one. Another candy thief. Not only did this jerk steal our Halloween candy, he also stole the bowl. A full-grown adult. Talk about pathetic not to mention sad. Two people dressed for Halloween used a crowbar and broke and removed this doorbell cam. I get that it was Halloween, but what the hell is wrong with people these days? Keep an eye on even your ring cams. Boo. It's one thing to steal all the candy but my bins too. Please bring them back you can keep the candy. We tried to be nice and keep candy out for kids to take and someone stole the entire bowl. We hope you enjoyed the video. We upload new content weekly. Please consider showing your support by hitting that like and subscribe button. In doing so you won't miss out on new content uploaded weekly, most times daily. Hit that subscribe button now. Join the family and be part of the Twisted TV crew today. Until next time, keep it classy, stay safe and always be vigilant my friends. And thanks for watching.